D232. So first of all, we're here at your uh, release party for your uh, new supplement company. Company, Can you talk a little bit, bit about uh, the supplement and why you decided to create your own supplement? Yes, it's Fight Farm. I do it with Ili Latifi. We do it together and we have a great team behind us. We decided to do this because it's a big, it's a, it's a, it's a big deal in our career having nutrition around you, what kind of nutrition you should take whatsoever to, to push your to push your training even further and so we decided to why don't do it by ourselves and here we are with, with Fight Forum with a great team behind us and it's just it's, you know I'm proud of it and I, I'm, I'm very I'm very happy that we have a, a, a we have a product we really really enjoy and we're here now and, and people like looks like they, they appreciate that and and, and and the sky is the limit uh, was there anything that surprised you uh, because creating supplements especially in Sweden there's a lot of rules that you have to uh, adhere to was there anything that surprised you that was more difficult than you anticipated uh, no everything went, it's, it's been it's been uh, it's been it's been kind of easy. I, you know, I'm a fighter and and I'm I'm not a I'm not a chemist. So, you know, we have a really good communication in the team. But I let the experts do what they're good at. I train, I test the stuff, and I'm super happy about the product. And and uh, and uh, you know, we know it's from it's 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 based from Sweden. We know exactly what's in it, and it tastes great. It looks good. And and it's me and Nilly. We we are we're the we're the faces out. So so, so like like a reference. I'm, I'm, this is this is this is just what I choose to, to, to take because it's a, such a big 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 deal of our, our training and our, our our day basically. And and uh, and uh, yeah, it's for everybody. It's for everybody. And and uh, it's just it's just an amazing product. Recently, there's been quite a lot of fighters that be, has been caught uh, by USADA and um, because of tainted supplement. Was uh, did that play a part in the reason why you chose to make your own supplement company? Of course, because you you can't really trust anybody when it comes to to the stuff you 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 take. You know, when it comes to supplements and nutrition and stuff like that. So, so that's of course uh, is a uh, one of the big factors too, and. Uh, you know, we 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 we, are, we have a team behind. We are a team. Me, me and Ilya, we do it. We train together. We're a team in training. We're a team in, in in this business now too. And and I just I just see the future. It's gonna be it's gonna be really good for us both. And and, and uh, with, with with this behind us and 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 uh, our, our fights are coming up. Everything is just going great now. It's it's really good. This year has been really great for uh, Swedish MMA. We have two participants in the Ultimate Fighter. You were getting a title shot. We, uh, the Swedish national team, did really well at the IMF Europeans and uh, probably going to do really well at the World uh, World Championships coming up. Uh, do you think that you? Uh, what part do you play in uh, making Swedish MMA grow? And uh, like, what's the reason why Sweden is so good, even though we're a real small country? I don't know what part I have. I just. Uh I'm just I'm just enjoying the ride and and it's, it's it's been a great couple of years and I think we just I think we just started we're going to be even a bigger MMA nation in the future and um, I don't know it's a good question we have great talents great competitors we have good gyms all over the all over the country so it's just a start so moving on to your fight with John Jones, he's been called a lot of names lately, snitch and uh, a gangster or a liar and a drug cheat. Uh, is there a specific um, like name you would call him, or would you just or are you going to stick with like the greatest of all time, as you said earlier in the press conference? No, he's the greatest of all, all time. That's how I see it. That's how I see him. You know, I don't care about the other stuff. And I'm just, it's just, it's, I'm just, I'm just, I'm just so, so uh, motivated to fight, to fight against him. You know, he could be by the belt and fight someone else. But this, just fighting him, is a motivation itself. It's not about the belt anymore. It's about fighting the best guy in the world and, and uh, by, in the history of the UFC, in my, in my opinion. And now I'm getting the belt too. So it's, it's. Uh, 
So, yeah, I'm excited, super excited, and I can't wait to 29th of December. I'm, I'm really looking forward to it. Uh, has your footwork got even better now that you have to run after your child and make sure that she doesn't get hurt? Oh, yeah, my footwork is, is, is so good. My boxing is good, my grappling, my, my, everything is just, I just had this, this year of, of, of uh, off competition. I've just been growing as a fighter and put shit together and, and become a complete MMA fighter. So I feel much better. So you fought Jones in 2014, one of the best fights we've ever seen in the UFC. Uh, what do you feel like is uh, the key to beat him this time around? No, I'm going to be in the best shape of my life. I'm going to put pressure on him. I mean, he's not going to get this distance he needs. And uh, I'm going to finish strong. I'll finish strong in every round. And do you think the, there's a slight advantage that he's not considered a champion because the belt is vacant? That maybe the judges will give him less leeway than they did in the first fight because he was such a dominant champion? No, I don't know. It doesn't matter to me. I'm going to make sure I dominate the whole fight. That's what you have to do a guy, a guy like, like this. You can't be too close fighting this guy because he makes sure he finishes off strong. That's his, that's his strength. So I'm going to make sure I dominate the fight from the start. I have to. There is no other way. You had a very bold prediction earlier at the press conference. Could you repeat it for your English-speaking fans? How do you think this fight is going to end? His head is going to hit the floor in the fourth round and knock him out. And your good friend and training partner Eli Latifi is also fighting on the card. Uh, how do you see his fight with uh, Corey Anderson playing out? It's going to smash him. It's, it's going to smash him from start. And how, is, how important is it for your preparation that uh, both of you are uh, trying to peak at the same time? Is it more intense that because you, you usually train together, but is it more intense now that he's also preparing for, to fight on the same night? Yeah, yeah, we, we, we have each other backs. We're going we're gonna to be training together and, and peak at the same time. So it's, it's, a, big, it's, it's, a, it's a big motivation and it's good to have someone having your back under this time. And, and you have someone to, to compete with too, you know, with the same, now we're friends and everything, but in training we compete every day. So, so it's going to give us a good push for both of us. And we're going to be, we're going to be even better, even in better shape more motivated, we're going to be ready for the, for the, for the, for the missions. Uh, any final words for your fans uh, before we wrap up, wrap up this interview? Those m don't miss 29th of December when I knock John Jones out. That's it. All right, 29th of December, you heard it here. The future three-time title challenger, Alexander Gustafsson, he promises to knock out John Jones. Don't miss it. UFC 232 on pay-per-view Las Vegas. Alex, thank you very much. Good luck in the fight. Thank you. Appreciate it. Thank you.